Hello, everybody. I'd like to invite you to join me in the Sanity Project, which is a six month long program, learning journey and community exercise in establishing an island of sanity in a world that's kind of going crazy. Um, I, I believe that we are really facing some turbulent times ahead when we will when when our ordinary structures of sense and meaning will be under assault and even our understanding of who we are and what is real will be under stress uh, and, and what is insanity or madness but a dissolving of what is real and this this questioning of of who am i um, now that doesn't have to be insanity. It's actually a very natural process. And we can hold each other through that process. I don't know about you guys, but during the pandemic, I had a lot of times, uh, most of the time I thought the world has gone crazy. But in the darker moments, I thought, maybe I'm crazy, and the world is fine. And I couldn't always break out of those, uh, those those funks um, under my own power. What brought me out was other people affirming through their words, through their actions, through their courage even, affirming what I knew to be true and that, that I couldn't hold as true without some help. So that's the motivation of this program. It's that we will establish sanity together that doesn't mean that we agree with each other's every opinion, but that we have a deeper kind of agreement. <laughs> There's a train going by. See, part of the insanity would be to pretend that we have perfect conditions all the time. And to like, even like in any kind of highly produced video, there's a little bit of uh, a lie there. And this constant uh, dishonesty it corrodes our, our sense of belonging in the world. It, it, it's alienating. So, you know, that's just kind of a, a real life immediate example of what I'm talking about. And, and this video is very similar to a lot of what I will be offering in this program. Uh, often it'll, it'll be short provocations like this. Sometimes we'll do much longer sessions um, so that we can, uh, together really stand in not not common opinions but but a an underlying agreement of of identifying and trusting our most authentic convictions because the doubt that that I experienced and probably a lot of you experienced during the pandemic or at other times was toxic you know it was it wasn't humility it was a, a kind of a self sabotage um, yeah, we are in a time of shifting stories that makes us vulnerable to uh, comforting but false narratives that replace the lost meaning and, and identity with something else. Uh, and it could be cults and conspiracy theories or, or just the narrow orthodoxy that prevails today uh, or extremist beliefs, um, fundamentalism of various kinds. And so this is our purpose also is to hold center together, not center in terms of compromise, but center in terms of embodiment. Uh, so there's a lot more and it'll evolve over the six months. Um, I honestly don't have it all planned out right now, although I sense uh, a path uh, ahead. So yeah, I really, um, if any of this resonates with you, then I invite you to join the program. My name is, by the way, Charles Eisenstein, and I will um, host the program along with um, my beautiful former wife, Patsy. Thank you.